Hello everybody and welcome back to Sweet and Crafty. Mama Z is here. So I am back in my studio and today we are going to be testing some products. As you know, movie Disney Wish recently came out. I think it came out November 22nd. Yeah, so somewhere in the end of November. I personally have not watched it yet, but I've been seeing so many products for it including toys, dolls obviously, but then they also have merch like clothes and pajamas and socks. They even have cereal. I saw cereal Cheerios had Asha on the box too. So I found something right here. I actually found a few of them, but I'm gonna review I think two today. We have nail polishes and I do my own nails at the house. My nails actually right now are done for Christmas, but either way I wanted to go ahead and test these nail stickers and uh, these nail polishes we have lots of different colors as you see right there and these colors are really really pretty okay let's go ahead and start testing them all right so here I actually have the main character from the movie her name is Asha and here are our nail polishes that we are going to test well nail polishes and actual stick-on nails I think I'm gonna start with the stick-on nails first I have gel nail polish right now on my nails. I don't want to take it off. I prepared baby wipes. I'm gonna be wiping the nail polishes off after I sample them. Here are the actual stick-on nails. Now let's see closer what do we have here. All right, so we have Rose because it's a kingdom of roses, so I think that's what it is. Then we have some symbols that resemble me a lot of Disney Frozen because as you know that movie also has lots of symbols, signs. Then we have the magic star. We have five of them. One, two, three, four, five. Then I'm not sure what these mean. I'm sure they do have specific meaning in the movie. Here's the like a snowflake or star with roses. Queen Amaya and King Magnifico. So they are the same. They just come on different uh, backgrounds. And of course we have Asha. Uh, one, two, three. These are definitely very tiny, but I'll try my best to fit some on my nails. Next, I'm gonna put Queen Amaya on my middle finger like that. That one is a good fit. Now, King Magnifico gonna go on my index finger. Next one is the ring finger. For the ring finger, I'm gonna use picture of Asha. I'm thinking between these two. I kind of like this one a lot. And for my pinky, I love this one. Purple one with the star. Well, they actually fit really good besides this one. This one did not fit and they stay on really well. Let me tell you that. <laughs> I'm gonna go with this black one. Next one, I'm gonna go with Asha. And the middle finger, I'm gonna use star. A ring finger. <laughs> Let's see what, what's this one. Queen Amaya. Let's go ahead and use King Magnifico one. What you think? Just don't pay attention to these two. But besides that, I think they look great. And now is the test. I'm gonna try and remove these. And keep in mind, I did not prep my nails at all. Because usually you need to clean the surface, remove all the oils from your nails but they are glued pretty good on there. It actually even hurts just a little bit, me removing these, but it's, it's totally manageable. I, I mean, it's a good thing because that just means that they're gonna last quite a while. All right, so this portion is finished. Next, we are going to test the actual nail polishes. That is an interesting part because I wouldn't be worried if I didn't have any nail polish right now. However, I do. Good thing is that I have some white nails. The color should show up way better than, let's see, on the red one. And here are the colors we have. We have yellow sparkly, then light pink sparkly, hot pink sparkly, blue sparkly, two shades of purple. We have purple and lavender, both sparkly. Then we have gray and white, also both sparkly. So all of them have sparkles, which is understandable because this movie is about magic star. So, okay, obviously always shake 
the nail polish before. Oh, wait a minute, I didn't mention that. So this one is um, mango scented nail polish. What? I had no idea they also scented. So it's mango scented and we have Valentino the goat on this one. Okay, so actually coverage is pretty good. I would go with two coats, but since I have white under, one coat works just fine. And you see the glitter? I'm not sure if you can. I can, it may not show up on the camera. Okay, I'm gonna clean it. Wow, it's already starting to dry, so it dries pretty fast. It does smell like mango, but also it smells like nail polish. Okay, so next one is Peach scented nail polish with Queen Amaya. I love anything peach scented or flavored. And this one actually very pleasant smell. I'll be honest on that one. Super pleasant smell. And this one does not smell like nail polish. Let's see what it looks like. I love it. I love it from the first stroke of the brush. It's definitely the color I would wear on a daily basis. It's very pale. I know it's hard to see it because I have white under, but it's definitely a very beautiful color and I like the glitter in it. Also, next we have pink one. And this one is cherry scented with Asha. I know I'm gonna love this one because this is such a pretty hot pink color. Perfect for spring. I would not wear it in winter time, but summer and spring, this would be my to-go color for sure. So for the pink one, since it's a darker, very bold color, I would do two applications. And it certainly does smell like cherry. Okay, let's do the lighter shades first. I know it's gonna be so hard to see because I already have white. <laughs> Vanilla scented, I'm going to smell it. And we have Asha on it and the star. Okay, so this one does not smell like vanilla at all. It actually does not smell good at all. <laughs> I do not like this one. I'm going to sample it just so we get an idea. Oh, actually nice. It's very like white white. You know what I mean? Sometimes... Uh oh. Don't do that. <laughs> what I'm trying to say, sometimes you buy a white nail polish and it's more of a bone color or more of a warmer tone or cooler tone. And this one is gray. And look! I cleaned the nail polish, but the glitter stayed on me, which I don't mind. <laughs> I love glitter. This one I cannot open. Do you want to hear something funny? You saw me struggling with this nail polish. My husband had to go downstairs and literally use the tools to open this one up. It was so glued together. Crazy. Actually, now looking at it, I'm still seeing gray, but there is definitely a lavender um, shade to it. And this one is lavender scented, but this one smells like um, white glue and lavender. And it's extremely sheer. Like there is hardly any coverage. I mean, when you blob the color on it, you see it, but then you start spreading it and color disappears. So that one is definitely... <laughs> If you're talking about one out of ten, I don't know, two maybe? Light lavender shade next. Beautiful color. Wow, this one is so, so, so pretty. I'm obsessed with this one. I hope you're seeing the colors properly because it's very hard to adjust my exposure on my camera. Grape scented. And yes, oh, this one smells so good. Oh, in the picture we have Asha, different birds, and star sitting in the middle. All right, dark purple next, berry scented, great coverage, very dark purple, definitely one of my favorites. Unfortunately, the smell is not good, just smells like nail polish, do not smell berries. And the last blue one, we have Asha and her friend Dahlia, and this one is blueberry scented, it's nice, rich shade of blue like almost like navy blue i say and probably has the best coverage out of all unfortunately it does not smell like blueberry oh well and everyone that's it for this video uh, these stick on nails as well as these nail polishes work very well 
Let me know in the comments below if you already watched Disney Wish in the movie theaters or you're planning on waiting for the movie to come out on DVD. Also, let me know which nail polish is your favorite from this set. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!